A South African scientist has patented an improved method to purify water for drinking purposes and it will be used in one of the first solar-powered desalination plants in Cape Town to deliver safe, clean water to low-income communities. Water scientist Murendeni Mafumo's dream is that everyone should have access to clean drinking water. Growing up in Limpopo, he recalls people walking for long distances to fetch water from the nearest river. When he started working with municipalities 10 years ago, an idea was born. Mafumo improved on an existing purification system with the use of nanofibers and macadamia nut shells. This system will now be used in a solar-powered desalination plant at the VNA waterfront. A corporate partner will buy the water from the plant. The funds raised from this will be used to build and operate a plant at an informal settlement to provide water to, among others, schools for free. For every single litre of water that anyone purchases from us, we're able to give um, 20 litres for free to, uh, through our systems in informal settlements. And we've been doing this um, right now in, in, in Pumalanga, we've been doing this in Limpopo, and now um, in the Western Cape we are scaling it uh, through the desalination plants. Mafumo believes this model of small, independent water purification systems is the future. We see this in the state of California, we've seen this in Israel, where more and more companies are having their own sources of water, more and more hotels and lodges are having their own sources of water, and, um, and, then, the, and then that doesn't put a strain in the municipal system, which puts a strain in communities that can't afford um, water. So I think this is the future where systems will be decentralized, will be more smaller systems. The plant at the VNA waterfront is expected to operate by October. And another plant at Monwabisi, near an informal settlement, 30 kilometers away, will follow six months later. Mariska Buerta, SABC News, Cape Town.